Bye, Peterbug. Have fun in Sweetwood. Bye. The Sweetwood Chorus. You can say it with a hug. If you say it with a burp, say excuse me. Don't you? before our concert tonight? You mean you're rehearsing right now? Right here? With your wonderful voices? <sighs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone. We're just on our way to the clinic. Let's let them practice, Popcorn. Later! <laughs> Bye! I love your singers! Okay, Sweetwood Chorus, let's get back to rehearsal. Yeah! <laughs> let's do it! Yay! Why don't we go over the Big solo. Pippin, are you ready? You bet. I've been practicing and practicing and practicing all day with no break. Hmm. Let's practice. Okay. A five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, ah. Tell the world how you feel. Say it quietly or loudly. Huh? Solo? Let those feels be revealed. Stand up tall and sing them proudly. Nice one, Juno. Someday you're gonna get your own solo too. I solo? <laughs> yep, someday for sure. But right now, it's time to do what we do before every concert. Let's play Hide, Hide and, and sing. sing. Hide and Sing? Hide and Sing is a Sweetwood course tradition. It's just like hide and seek, except even better. You get to sing everything. <laughs> you sing first. Five, four, three, two, one. <clears throat> Ready or not, here I come. Here I come. Pippin, I hide long time. I win! Hope? What you say? That? Uh, what? <gasps> oh, we go to Vita! Vita the vet. She will take great care of you. Pippin? Juno? I get to see the chorus twice in one day? I'm the luckiest hamster in Sweetwood! Oh, yeah. What seems to be the problem? You were singing and then you couldn't? Oh, no! Let's get you in to see Vita! Hmm. Your throat looks a little red. Did you strain your voice today? What did Pippin say? I think she's saying she doesn't know what strain means. It means if you use your voice too much or too loudly, you might have heard it. Pippin loud. Well, my diagnosis is you lost your voice. Oh no! But don't worry. I'll have you feeling better in one, two, three. We just need to soothe your throat. 
That might help your voice come back. First, you need to gargle with warm salt water. <gasps> she doesn't know what gargle means. <laughs> the salt in the water can help your throat feel better. Wanna try? Gargle no work. Still no voice. Not to worry. You can also try some honeysuckle tea with extra honey. Honey can soothe your throat too. Wow, she must love drinking tea. Well, fun fact, koalas don't drink like we do. They get water from the leaves they eat. But it looks like Pippin enjoys yummy tea, too. Your throat feels a little better? But Pippin, no voice. Then my last recommendation is vocal rest. She doesn't know what... I got it. Vocal rest is when you don't talk, or shout, or whisper, or sing. She said, what about the concert? <gasps> hey, what about the concert? I'm sorry you lost your voice, Pippin. Maybe if you rested all day, you'll come back in time for the concert. Oh no, now what we do? Tell the others. Pippin lose voice. But where voice go? What you say, Pippin? Maybe you should go help translate. I'll handle things around here. If you say so. <laughs> They're back! Where were you two? Can we get back to rehearsing now? Uh, is this a new game? <gasps> How do we play? Ah, Pippin lost her voice, so she went to get a checkup. Now she has to rest it until it feels better. Pippin, no sing. Oh, no. Pippin, no sing? What about the concert? Well, if Pippin rests her voice all day, maybe it'll come back in time for the concert. So, what should we do now? It's rehearsal time! Ooh, 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 oh. Faster! Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah. Higher! Ah. Boots and cats and boots and cats. And cats and boots. Do ba da do. She said, Tidbit, that bass line sounded so good it made me want to climb a giant tree. What can I say? I have a gift. It's time for the concert! We gotta go! We do it! Oh, Vita here! How's it going, Pippin? She's been resting all day. So, her voice must be back, right? Right? Let's find out. Wanna give it a try? But your throat feels better. That's because you've been resting it all day. Good job, Pippin. I'm sure if you keep resting it, your voice will come back really soon. But the concert's right now! And everyone's here to see us perform. What are you going to do? What are we going to do?
what Pippin say? I've got it this time. She says, run away! No, no, she says her paws are itchy. Pippin fans! Ding, 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 you got it. I love this idea. Cause now Pippin can still be part of the show. Oh, oh good plan. Yes. But oh no. Who's gonna sing Pippin solo? I solo? Any way you say it, every way you say it, you can sing it, write or play it, share how you feel. Ooh, ah. You can say it with a chirp, you can say it with a hug, if you say it with a burp, say excuse me, don't just shrug. Any way you say it, every way you say it, you can sing it, write or play it, share how you feel. of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. Now all he needs is a nose. Bye, Papa. And <laughs> bye-bye, Snow Daddy. Bye, Vita Doodle. Have fun in Sweetwood. Now, where'd that carrot go? I'm so excited for the Sweetwood Winter Skate. All of Sweetwood will be at the ice rink later. And there'll be twinkling lights and music and cocoa and... And ice skating! Huh? Oh, look! The chipmunks must be going to the rink to practice their ice skating. And, fun fact, a group of chipmunks is called a scurry. Oh, Popcorn, how about we go check out the ice skating before we open up the clinic? I love that idea! <gasps> Vita! Something's wrong with the ice! No one's skating on it! Don't worry, Popcorn. Potter's just cleaning the ice. Right. I knew that. I was just saying if you knew that. Hey, Vita and Popcorn, we're here for the big skate. We love skating. We love it, too. We'll be back as soon as we're done in the clinic. Bye. Great. See you later. Prickly, Whoa. I didn't see you there. 
Are you here to practice ice skating too? Who, me? Um, well, I don't really feel like ice skating right now. I mean, sure, I'd love to practice. Practice makes pretty good, but I actually don't have my skates because I left them at home, even though I meant to bring them, I just accidentally forgot. Makes sense. Okay, Prickly, maybe we'll see you later. Bye-bye. All right, everyone. The rink is open and safe for skating. Um... Hey, why don't you just borrow some ice skates, Prickly? I have some. Yeah, I guess I could. Oh, but I didn't actually bring my helmet either because I left that at home also. <gasps> You're in luck. I brought two. Thanks, Tidbit. That's so nice. Oh, but I can't wear yours. My quills will poke holes in it. And then you got a helmet with holes, and that's no good. Go on, skate without me. I'm fine, I promise. Okay, catch you later. <sighs> I wish I could skate with them. I call this the tidbit. Because I'm on my skates just a tidbit. <laughs> Okay, I call this one the Zigzag, cause uh, my, my name's Zigzag. Zigzag! Impressive. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> hmm, Prickly looks really sad. Even though he said he didn't want to ice skate, maybe he really does. I think you're right, Tidbit. Hey, Prickly, are you sure you don't want to come practice ice skating with us? Even just for a little? Well, it's just that, um... My extra skates are still available. And so's my extra helmet. And the ice is extra smooth. Um... Well, all right. Yay! Yay! Prickly's gonna Yay! skate with us! You got this, Prickly. Just take it nice and slow. All you gotta do is put one foot in front of the other. It's like walking. <laughs> nope, nothing like walking. In fact, this is way harder than walking. Come on, Prickly. Here goes nothing. I got this. I got this. Whoa. I don't got this. Whoa. Sorry, did I say how sorry it was? Are you okay? Allow me to fix this. Actually, I know who can fix this. Looks like we need a, need a bell. Who always knows just what to do. Let's go to Vita, Vita the vet. She will take great care of you. No! Vita, please save him. Do your checkup thing, come on. Check his heartbeat! Ah! Uh, okay, um, vets don't usually treat snowmen. But hamsters do! My diagnosis is... Your snowman is melting. Take him outside and he'll feel better in one, two, three. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, where's his nose? Oh, <laughs> here you go. Wonder who that is? Hi, Vita! We got quilled. It was my fault. We were practicing our ice skating when Prickly slipped and fell. His quills flew off and hit us. But it's not so bad. Prickly, are you okay? Who, me? Oh, I'm fine, totally fine, absolutely 100% A-OK. -okay. I mean, I feel bad about what happened, but I'm not bummed or bruised or anything, so totally good here, no problems at all. There you go, all better. Would you two mind going to the waiting room? I just want to take a sack to make sure Prickly's okay from his fall. Sounds good. Thanks, Vita. Right this way, you two. I can't wait to get back on the ice. You don't need to check on me. 
I told you, I'm fine. I'm all good. No boobos here whatsoever. I know you're not hurt, Prickly, but maybe something else is wrong. Maybe something you didn't want to say in front of your friends. Now that you mention it. Turns out I don't know how to skate. No idea. I've never learned, but I didn't want to tell them because I didn't want them to know. So I said I didn't want to skate, but it looked so fun, so I tried, but I fell. And let me tell you, that was embarrassing. My clothes went everywhere, Vita. Can you imagine? Everywhere! Slow down, Prickly. Okay, take a deep breath like this. Oh, that's nice. But Vita, now I never want to skate again. Like, ever. Except it looks so fun. I think I have a solution. Tibbit and Zigzag are great at skating, but before they could be great, they had to learn. If you want to ice skate, no point in waiting. But who's going to teach me? That's my concern. Ask your friends. What if they say no way or say they aren't sure? Ask your friends. I want to teach you. That's what friendship is for. Ask my friends. What if they skate away? Because teaching is a bore. Ask your friends. I want to teach you. That's what friendship is for. But skating is just so brand new. I really don't know what to do. I might wobble, I might slip Get too chilly, I could trip And who is gonna help me when I fall and wanna try again? Ice is slippy, ice is slidey I need experts who can guide me Ask your friends and you'll have so much fun With what you have in store Ask your friends and they will teach you They will teach me? Yes, I'm sure Ask your friends, cause that's what friendship is for! Thanks, Vita. I'm gonna go ask my friends for help. Sounds great, Prickly. Okay. I promise this one's mine. Ask my friends, 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 ask my friends. Ask my friends. Ask my friends! <laughs> I mean, I want to skate. Woohoo! It's about time! Put on those skates! Wait, wait. I want to skate, but I don't know how. I didn't know how to tell you. Will you teach me? It's okay if you don't want to. Of course we want to. That's what friends are for. Tidbit's the one who taught me how to skate. Really? Yeah. Everyone's got to learn somehow. And don't worry. We've got plenty of time before the big skate. I've got the best friends. Whoa, whoa. Whoa! I think you're ready, Prickly. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Sweetwood Winter Skate. Wow, it's amazing. What are your moves? Mine? Thanks. Look at you. You're skating on the ice and you're doing great. I know. You were right, Vita. My friends were happy to teach me because that's what friends are for. But wait, where's popcorn? Okay, this is seriously the last one. Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube.
day. Pita, you're gonna wanna see this? It's... <gasps> snow! Snow, 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 snow! Let's get out there. Oh, my way to speed up for the snowy day! Bye, Dad. Bye, Papa. Uh, wait a second. Uh, wait. <laughs> You've got a bundle up, Vivi. Yeah, it's snowing out there. And it's important to keep your body warm when it's cold out. You're right. Thanks. are my favorite food? <laughs> then you're gonna have plenty to snack on today. Come on, let's go! Wait! Uh... Hmm... Okay, continue. The bat is in... That's me! The bat is in... Hello! Giant dozen ostrich! Or me as a bug. Whoa. Everyone's welcome for checkups and hugs! The bat is in... <laughs> what was that? <gasps> Is everyone okay? <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> we're great! That was awesome! <laughs> Let's go again! That looks like a lot of fun. Be careful and stay warm. <laughs> we will! Oh, Zigzag, do you want to bundle up? You need to keep your body warm when you're playing out in the cold. No way! Don't you know about bunny fur? No? Well, fun fact, a bunny's fur is thicker in the winter because they stop shedding to keep warm, but... Exactly. So, I don't have to bundle. But it's always best to wear winter clothes when you're playing in the snow. Right, when you're not a bunny with thick fur that keeps you warm. Well, if you get chilly, you can always come inside to warm up. Okay, but I won't. Let's get back inside where it's warm. Have fun, friends. Bye. <gasps> come on, Zigzag. <laughs> Let's make snow angels. Whee! <laughs> Here I come. Woo! <laughs> Are you cold, Zigzag? Do you want to put on some mittens? No, no. I'm fine. We should make a snowman. Oh, I know. A snow vita. That idea is great. Agreed. <laughs> uh, Zigzag? You sure you don't want to bundle up? You look kind of freezing. What? No! I'm fine. I've got fur. Remember? Oh, right. Hmm. This Snow Vita is missing something. Something Vita-ish. Oh, I bet there's something in the clinic that'll be good for that. Yeah, uh, something of Vita's. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. Uh, yeah, be right back. You've just got a small mouse sore, Grandpa Beaver. It'll heal up on its own. But in the meantime, you can make it feel better by putting something cold on it. Ice chips, please, popcorn. Ice chips! Oh, <laughs> thank you, popcorn. <sighs> Thanks for the ice chips, you two. I feel better already. Bye! Hi, Grandpa Beaver. <laughs> oh, hi, Zigzag. Ah, uh, warm. Hi, Vita. Hi, Popcorn. Oh, Zig Zig, you look so cold. What? C cold? <laughs> no. I just came in to, uh, to... To warm up? No, for, uh... For a tissue? Well, I, I could use one. 
You've definitely got the sniffles, Zigzag. And it's probably from being outside in the cold. Okay, so you got your tissues. You going back out for more freezing fun now? Uh oh, uh, um. Uh, yeah, R right after I. <gasps> oh, yeah, after I ask if Vita has an extra stethoscope I can borrow? Oh, sure. Here you go. Thanks, Vita. Hey, Zigzag. Wanna bundle up? No, thanks. I I'm good. I'm a bunny. I know just what this Snow Vita needs. A stethoscope. Yes, that's perfect. <laughs> now let's build a snow popcorn. Now it's time for snow catch. <gasps> your fur free from ice and snow, Koa. We don't want it to get all icy again. Thanks, Vita. Vita, Zigzag needs your help. Oh, Zigzag, what's wrong? Burr. We uh, think she got too cold. Burr. Don't worry, Zigzag. We'll get you warmed up in one, two, three. Popcorn, can you get a blanket, please? Thank you. I get it. Sometimes we forget to pay attention to how our body is feeling while we're having fun. Let's see. You're shivering and your teeth are chattering. You've got a runny nose, too. I think you need a checkup. No frostbite. That's good. Thermometer! And no fever. My diagnosis is... You got way too cold. But don't worry, I know exactly what you need to do. And I bet she's gonna tell you in a song. <laughs> You're right, Popcorn. It's a snowy day, so of course you wanna play. But if you don't wanna freeze out there, you do need to wear these out there. A hat for your head. Any color works, but I choose red. A scarf for your neck. I'll be feeling cozy in a sec. A sweater for your chest. Remember it when you get dressed. And that's, that's how you keep your body warm. And that's all? No way! A jacket, zip it up. Uh, can you ask for help with zipping? Yep. Mittens for your hands. And gloves can also be for hands. Boots for your feet. And now your winter gear's complete. And that's how you keep your body warm. Yeah! And that's how you keep your body warm. Bundle up and cozy toasty warm. And there's one other way. Hi, Coco! Yes, yes, oh, yes. yes please. This is yummy and warms my paws. I'm feeling better already. If everyone's roasty and toasty again, maybe we should try out our new snow fort? Yay! Are you sure you're completely warm now? You shouldn't go back outside if you're still chilly. Toasty warm. And good to go back out in the cold. But can you sing me that better song first? <laughs> sure. You're all better, you're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> Forgetting something? Oh, yeah. Do you and Popcorn want to come outside and play with us? 
No more patience today. Then yes, yes. But are you forgetting anything else? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I definitely need mittens. And maybe a hat. And a scarf. I got you covered, Zigzag. Hat, scarf. And do you have a puffy coat? And thermal socks? And boots? Yes, yes, and yes. You were right, Vita. Staying warm while you play in the cold is the best way to play in the cold. I hope everybody's ready for snow tag! On, On your, your marks, marks, get set, set, wait! What? I need a snack. Ooh. Uh, hmm. Delish. Now I'm ready. Let's go! Ha <laughs> 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 Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. Want a pack a snack to take with you? No thanks, just had my favorite one. Bye, Dad and Papa. Bye, baby. Have fun in Sweetwood. Popcorn, time to go. I can't wait to give lollipops to all our patients today. I'm gonna be the lollipop giver outer. <laughs> You'll be the best lollipop giver outer. Hey, what's your favorite flavor, Vita? Well, lollipops are a treat for patients, and I'm the vet, not the patient. But I guess I'd say. Wait, let me guess. Hmm. I guess. I guess. I guess I need a clue. <laughs> okay. My favorite flavor is a fruit that has a peel. <laughs> oh, is it banana? Nope. Oh! Ouch! Oh no, Vita, are you okay? Um, I rolled my ankle the wrong way, but yep, I'm okay. Are you sure? I'm sure, I'm sure. It was just a tiny trip. Plus, the vet is in. Hey, that's my line. The bet is in. That's me. The bet is in. Hello. Giant as an orca or teeny as a bug. Everyone's welcome for checkups and hugs. The bet is in. <laughs> and now, the bet is out. <laughs> huh? Today's schedule is all house calls, and they're happening all over Sweetwood. Oh, well, we better go pack up the essentials. Bandages, thermometer. <laughs> we probably don't need to bring that. Ew, that's a relief. But you know what we do need to bring with us? Who? 
Oh, please don't say the bathtub. <laughs> no, the lollipops. Oh, <laughs> of course. As the official lollipop giver outer, let me just make sure we have enough for all our patients. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a yes. Our first patient is Mama Mouse. Let's go give her a lollipop. I mean a checkup. Your cut is healing nicely, Mama Mouse. Keep keeping it clean, and it'll be better in one, two, three. And when will your ankle be all better? Did you trip? How did you know? Mamas always know. Would you like some ice for your ankle, Vida? No, I'm the vet, not the patient, but thanks. Voila! Cheddar cheese flavor? Mmm, my favorite. Thanks, popcorn. Anytime. Mama Mo said, cheddar cheese? My favorite flavor. Can you believe I guessed it? I guess that's why they made me the lollipop giver outer. <laughs> you made you the lollipop giver outer. And it's a good thing I did. I'm amazing at it. But I still need to guess your favorite flavor. Can I have another clue? Let's see. It's a fruit so round, you could roll it down a hill. Watermelon! Nope, that's not it. Huh? Our next patient will be Koa. Are you ready to get your eye patch off, Koa? Absolutely. This eye is very tired of looking at the inside of this eye patch. You can see the inside of the patch? Maybe he can, cuz... Fun fact, tigers can see very well in the dark. I don't know. What color is the inside of that eye patch? Blue. Wow. Just wow. Your eye is all better. Oh, thanks, Vida. How about one mango flavor lollipop for being such a patient patient? Oh, gorgeous! Thanks, popcorn. His favorite! How did you know? The lollipop giver outer always knows. Again! Wow! <laughs> Enjoy! Ow! Um, Vida? Looks like you hurt your ankle. Did you hurt your ankle? It sure looks like you did. I hurt my ankle once and I put ice on it. Want some ice? Aw, thanks, Prickly, but I'm the vet, not the patient. And I'm fine. How many more patients do we have today? This many. It only hurts a little. And I really want to help everyone who needs help today. Really, really. Okay. Bye -bye. See ya. Except your favorite flavor. I still haven't guessed it. Can I have one last clue? Please, please, please. It's a color you're looking at right now. Hmm. Maybe it's something purple like your vet vest. Is it <gasps> grape? Nope. Oh. Hey, popcorn. Yeah. If there are no more lollipops, does that mean there are no more patients for the day? Yep. <sighs> Good. Because I think I need a vet. I mean a doctor. <laughs> oh, no. Is it your ankle? It really did feel fine at first, but I think walking made it worse. 
What can I do to help? I just really want to go home, but ugh, I don't know if I can make it. Ugh, my ankle hurts too much to walk now. You sit tight. And don't worry, Fat Tex always know what to do. What do I do? What do I do? Think, Popcorn! I want to take care of Vita. She always takes such good care of everyone else. <gasps> Wait. Everyone else! Hey, Pinky! Hurry, Pinky! Okay. Okay, help is on the way. Vida needs a, needs a vet. And I know just what to do because the vet tech helps the vet. And her patients will help too. Our vet Vita's always there to offer help and give us care. But Vita took a tiny trip, so vet and patient have to flip. I thought I could power through it, but my ankles hurt. Oh, Vita, I knew it. We're here for you, don't be upset. Sometimes a vet just needs a vet. Vida needs some, needs some help. Helpers sometimes need help too. So let's help Vida, Vida the vet. We will take great care of you. Thanks, everyone. Ready to go home? I'm ready. Thanks, friends. <laughs> Now that Vita's the patient, she needs a lollipop. But I still haven't guessed her favorite flavor. Hmm. Vita's favorite flavor is a fruit with a peel, so round it can roll down a hill, and a color I can see right in front of me. Ha <laughs> ha! Got it! This way. Easy does it. Wow, thank you all for taking such great care of me. Our pleasure. Of course. We learned from you. You always take the best care of all of us. Wait! There's one lollipop left. Oh no, I thought we finished helping every patient in Sweetwood. Except you. And I'm pretty sure I figured out your favorite flavor. <laughs> Orange, you glad I'm a good lollipop giver outer? Orange, my favorite. You guessed it, Popcorn. Boom! <laughs> Let's get you home. Bye, thank you, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Bye. See you better. See you later. Well, Vita. Take care, Vita. Mm. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Let's get you to a doctor. How'd you know? Dads and Papas always know. Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube.
Bye, Dad and Papa. Bye. <laughs> Have fun, Peter Pie. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, somebody's got a new hobby. Oh, roller skating isn't my hobby, Vita. It's part of my job now. I'm gonna be an even better vet tech from now on, cause I'll be fast. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Whoa. <laughs> Uh, see? Whoa! Oof. <laughs> Popcorn's okay. Are you sure you're ready to skate around in the clinic? The only way to know is to try, right? And practice makes... <laughs> I gotcha. <sighs> Thanks, Vida. To the clinic. Whoa! Everyone's welcome for checkups and hugs. The vet is in. Whoa. <laughs> Good morning, Mama Mouse. Good morning, Vida. I'm wondering if you could help me. I'm feeling a bit dizzy. I gotcha. Popcorn, could you bring Mama Mouse a glass of water, please? On it. Did you hit your head? Oh. Were you in the sun too long? No. I haven't even had the energy to go outside and garden lately. Hmm. Have you had enough? What? Water? Yes. Uh, I've had enough water. <sighs> hmm. You're yawning a lot. My diagnosis is you're very tired. Whoa! Sometimes when you don't get enough sleep, it can make you feel dizzy because your body needs rest. Do you feel well enough to head home for a nap? Yes. Oh. A nap at home sounds like, well, just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Thanks, Fida. Sorry for the spill. What? <laughs> what? Oh, are you okay? Oh, yeah, falls are good. They give you a reason to get back up and keep trying. Huh? Popcorn is okay. <clears throat> it's also important to learn how to fall. See, Vita, anytime you need a super fast vet tech, these skates are gonna come in very handy. Mm-hmm. For example, need a bandage? Well, then one bandage coming up fast. I always think you're fast enough, but that was faster than usual. Oh, um, hello, Papa Mouse. Uh, am I early or late? You don't have an appointment today, but come on in for a checkup. <sighs> Sounds good. Oh, uh, the exam room is this way. That sounds good, too. Reflexes are good. Now inhale. Exhale. Hmm. You seem very healthy, Papa Mouse. Oh, then why can't I remember anything? I was wondering that too. Popcorn, will you please grab me the big book of everything? Be back in a jiffy! <laughs> Thanks, Popcorn. That was pretty fast. Yes, you! Go, Popcorn! Go, Popcorn! Oh, Papa Mouse, it says here that if you don't get enough sleep, it can make you forgetful. Have you been getting the rest you need to feel your best? You know, I can't remember. Everything has been such a blur lately. Papa Mouse, my diagnosis is you're very tired. You need to get sleep so your brain and your body can rest. You're back! Follow me, cause I can't stop! <laughs> Hi, Papa. Mama brought me here cause I keep falling asleep everywhere, all the time. Hmm, well, that's not good. And we have 
no idea why. <sighs> Not again. Hmm. Has anything different been going on at the mouse house? The nights are so long. The days are all wrong. And don't even think of enjoying a moment of peace, cause this crying won't cease. Mama said not to call it annoying. Sunny! All through the house we hear. <coughs> all from one baby mouse we hear. <coughs> we've struggled, we've wept, but we sure haven't slept, cause all that we hear is. <coughs> Her diaper's been changed and then. <coughs> Her stuffies are arranged, but still yeah. She's warm and she's fat She just won't go to bed And she's hitting my head with her <laughs> Then more <laughs> We rock her and we We don't know what to do So we're hoping that you can stop <laughs> Looks like I just need to figure out the answer to one big question Is that woozy in here? Uh, was I early or late? Will Baby Mouse cry forever? <laughs> Not those questions I need to figure out what's making Baby Mouse cry in the first place. Got it. I think you need a checkup. <laughs> Aw, you don't want to chew on that. I'm awake! Wow, that was a sharp little bite. Wait a minute. A bite! Popcorn. Headband, please. I think I know what's making Baby Mouse cry. But I need to take a look in her mouth with my headlamp to be sure. Could you help me get her to open it? We'll try. Baby Mouse, can you say, ah? Uh... Open up, baby Say girl. Oh. You can do it, baby. Her mouth is open. <laughs> Aw, no wonder Baby Mouse has been crying so much. My diagnosis is Baby Mouse is teething. Oh, yum, no. Sorry, my love. Um, can somebody tell me what teething is, please? <clears throat> and can someone get me down, please? <laughs> oh, sorry, Popcorn. Teething is when a baby's teeth are coming in. The teeth pop through the baby's gums, and that can make them feel uncomfortable. Oh. Mama, did I teeth? You sure did. And all 18 of your teeth came in beautifully. Yep. And fun fact, unlike people and a lot of other animals, mice only have one set of teeth their whole lives. Wow, these are my teeth for life. <coughs> okay, Vida, so how can we help Baby Mouse feel better? <laughs> Stop crying! Quickly, please. I don't know how much more of this we can take. Well, when a baby's teething, biting something cold can help. I think I know just the thing. Don't worry, baby mouse. I'll have you feeling better in one, two, three. Popcorn, will you please grab a teething ring out of the freezer? Extra, extra small. Hurry! <laughs> Oh, I can hurry. I can hurry fast. I'll be back before you know it. Fast, fast, they're coming through. Woohoo! Ta Thanks, Viva. You're very welcome. And coochie, 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 coo. You're all better, you're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Looks like we've got some babysitting to do. <laughs> Aren't you glad I had my roller skates on today, Vita? Mm-hmm. Me too! And I don't know if you noticed, but I really improved. I can even do this. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I meant to do that. I guess I'm not the best skater. <laughs> not yet. But you are the best vet tech. And my best friend. Watch full episodes of Feet of the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. Day. The sun is super bright. Luckily, we'll be inside today because... The bet is in. That's me. The bet is in. Oh! oh. <laughs> Hi, Tibbet. Hi, Vita. Hi, Popcorn. You'll never guess where I'm going. Swimming? <gasps> what? But... How? How could you possibly... How did you know? Well, Tibbet, you have a towel, and goggles, and a floaty. Oh, you noticed. I'm on my way to the watering hole to swim and play. It's a perfect day for that. Sure is. Although, it's also the perfect day to get sunburned, which is why I brought my personal collection of sunscreen. <gasps> sunscreen! I knew I forgot something. Here, Vita. There. I put mine on before I left my house. Well, I'm glad everyone is wearing sunscreen to keep their skin from getting sunburnt on a sunny day. Are you kidding? Sunscreen is my middle name. I've got every kind. Look, and I don't just use it on swimming days. I use it whenever I'm in the sun. It's animal safe, too. 
Wow! Maybe sunscreen really is his middle name. Just remember, sunscreen wears off, especially if you're sweating or swimming. So you have to put more on a few times today. Don't forget! Oh, I definitely won't forget. I'll put more on as soon as I get to the watering hole. Have fun! Bye! Hi, everyone! Great day to swim and play! Mm. Hi, Fergie! Hi, Tidbit! Come on, we're gonna play water tag! Yeah, come play with us! Water tag? Ooh, I love water tag. But first things first, I gotta put on sunscreen. Oh. Here we are. I've got bottles, I've got tubes, I've got jars, and sprays, of course. Will you hurry up, please? Yeah, come on. We can't wait to play. Nuh-uh. Can't forget the important stuff. And what's important right now is... Ice lolly! Ice lollies! Oh, I love ice lollies! Me too! Me three! Oh! Oh! oh, 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 oh. oh no, Koa, are you okay? I got you great! Thanks, but I think I hurt my nose. Sorry about my sunscreen. It's supposed to prevent burns, not cause falls. I guess I know where we're going. Looks like we need a, need a vet. Who always knows just what to do. Let's go to Vita, Vita the vet. She will take great care of you. Your nose got quite a bump, Koa. But it should be fine. The ice pack will help. How long do I have to hold it on my nose? Until this timer goes off. The cold will help you keep your nose from swelling up. Plus, it'll keep you cool on this hot day. Oh, and speaking of hot days, did you put on more sunscreen, Tibbet? Uh, well, not yet. But I will. Sunscreen is my middle name, remember? I remember. You both need to put on sunscreen, too. Us? But we have fur. Mm-hmm. Yes, but fun fact. Even animals with fur can get a sunburn in places where the fur doesn't cover. So you've got to use sunscreen in those spots. Like this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Phew. <laughs> How are you feeling, Koa? <gasps> My boo-boo doesn't hurt anymore. Great! Then a one, two, three, four. You're all better, you're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Vita. Yeah, and don't worry. I'll make sure we're all sunscreened up. Don't forget! I will absolutely, positively, definitely not forget. Thanks again! See ya! And you can't forget either, Vita. Give me your hands. <laughs> Thanks, Pop Green. First things first, we are going to put on sunscreen. Oh, careful. My nose is still a little tender. There you go. And a little on your ears, Fergie. Thanks. Now can we please go and have some fun? Uh-uh. I still need to put some sunscreen on myself. Here we are. Hey, Tippet, catch! Ha-ha, <laughs> <laughs> let's play! Hooray! Yay! supposed to do, but I can't remember what it was.
fun. Building sandcastles? Ow! Well, I thought it was fun. It's not that. My skin feels stingy and burny. Your skin does look a little red, Tidbit. Yeah, I think you might have a sunburn. A sunburn? But, but, but I can't have a sunburn. I, I put on a whole bunch of... <gasps> oh no, I forgot to put on sunscreen! Why? Looks like we're going back to the vet. Do you feel dizzy? No. Is that bad? Have you been drinking a lot of water today? Yes. Is that bad? Nope. That's good. Too much sun can dry out your body and make you feel tired or dizzy. We want to make sure you're not dehydrated and that your body has all the water it needs to keep you feeling good. <sighs> I thought sunscreen was my middle name. But actually, it's just Theodore. Aw, don't worry. I'll treat your sunburn with some aloe. Aloe! What's aloe? It's a gel that comes from the aloe vera plant. It'll soothe your skin and help it feel better in a few days. I can't believe I forgot to put on sunscreen. Every time I was about to do it, something fun distracted me. Aw. Aw, don't be too hard on yourself, Tibbet. Everybody gets distracted by fun sometimes. That's why I make sure to take care of the important things right away. Everybody likes fun, everybody likes play, so remember this advice and you'll be a-okay. To keep a happy day from winding up at the worst, take care of the important stuff first. When the sun's shining down and the day's getting hotter, it's hard to stop the fun to grab a little drink of water. But listen to your body and remember your thirst. Take care of the important stuff first. I know what you mean. When the bathroom is calling, but you don't want to stop. Don't stay in play till you're ready to pop. Don't, don't wait, wait until, until you're feeling like, like you just might burst. Take care of the important stuff first. So remember, don't forget or get the order reversed. Prepare, be aware, and take care of the important stuff first. Rita, I will definitely take that advice. <gasps> but what if I do forget? How can I make absolutely positively sure I remember? I've got a great idea. Be right back. Huh? You can use this timer. Set it whenever you put on sunscreen, and when it goes off, you'll always remember to put more on. It's the perfect plan. Thanks, Vita. Tidbit Theodore Turtle is the sunscreen king again. Ice lollies for everyone! Hooray! <laughs> Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. Okay, Toby, your cast is all done, and it'll help your leg heal in no time. 
You just need to take it easy and rest. Pillow, please. Pillow. Crutches. Crutches. Marker. Marker. Can Popcorn and I sign your cast? Sure. There you go. Ah, Thanks, and wow-wee. You two are so great at working together. We're also great dancers, see? <laughs> we sure know how to work together, don't we, Popcorn? Yep. And a five, six, seven, eight. You're all ready, you're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> Thanks, Popcorn. Thanks, Vita. You're the best team in Sweetwood. Wow, Vita. We have a very long list of appointments today. We better get m uh, uh, choo moving. Uh-oh, Popcorn. That was a big sneeze. Are you feeling okay? Me? I feel great. Just uh, uh choo Popcorn. What? Mm hmm. I think we found an ex patient. Achoo! I think you need a checkup. Uh, checkup? That's right. I think you need a checkup. What checkup? All, All right. right. Let me take a look. It won't take very long. I'll make sure her team's strong. I think you need a checkup. Achoo! Get a listen to your heartbeat with my stethoscope. No, I was here first. No, I was. Vita? Hmm, I better go check on this. I'll be right back. Ah. Hip, Bertie. Oh, hi, Evita. We're so glad you're in. We're not sick. Nope, not sick. And we were um wondering can... if we could have one of your yummy lollipops, please. <laughs> I'm happy to help, but I just need to finish with Popcorn's checkup. Come on in. Now, where was I? Uh, uh, choo! All right, let's check your temperature with my thermometer. <sighs> choo! Oh, gotcha. Good type, Popcorn. And double good type from me. Just as I thought. My diagnosis is you have a cold. Popcorn, you're going to need some rest today. But, but, but who'll help you with all the patients that need checkups? Ooh, ooh, I can be the new popcorn. No, me, I'm very helpful. D I'm more helpful. I know, how about you both help me today? Woohoo! Yes! Achoo! Good night! For your first task, could you please take Popcorn to the recovery room to rest? And make sure he has somewhere to burrow. Cuz, fun fact, hamsters love to burrow and get all snuggly in a little tunnel of blankets. <laughs> it keeps them extra cozy. <laughs> Easy peasy. Right this way, Popcorn. So, Popcorn, where do you keep the lollipops? How's that? Good bro. He is very cozy. Achoo! <sighs> <laughs> Welcome, Tibbet. What seems to be the matter today? Well, Vita, I'm feeling a little hot and could use one of your feel better iced teas to cool down. I got this one, Vita. Tidbit, what flavor iced tea can I get for you? Raspberry Ripple? No way. Lickety Lemon is way better. Let me help. Lickety lemon? Raspberry ripple? You know, maybe only one helper should handle the tea. I'm on it. I'll get the ice. I got it. Oh! Uh oh. Coming through! What? Oops. <laughs> Fergie, 
Ready for our next patient. Hey. Hi, Banjo. Um, what's he doing all the way down there? Because Banjo hurt his foot, you could use some help coming upstairs for an x-ray. Could you please bring him up the patient elevator? Say no more, I'm on it. Paul! Whoa. I'm on it too! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Welcome, Banjo. Oh, good thing I was the better puller. What? I was definitely the better puller. Oh, yeah? Watch my technique. <laughs> That's nothing. Watch me and take notes. Ha! Whoa! Whoa! Kip, Fergie, can you pass me my headlamp? Kip, Fergie? Move over, I gotta help Vita. Me too. You move over. Whoa! <laughs> there you go, Banjo. You're all done now. Thanks, Vita. You're the best. And I think I'm feeling good enough to take the stairs. <laughs> Kit Fergie! There you are. Sorry we weren't there to help you, Vita. I'm ready now. I'm double ready. Great. It's really nice that you're both here to help. But remember, helping isn't a contest. It's all about teamwork. Don't worry, Perkly. I'm just going to use my magnifying glass to look at your scraped paw. Looks like you just need a bandage. I'll have you fixed up in a one, two, three. Yep, Fergie. Can you get one from the recovery room? I'm on it! You got it, boss! I told Vita I'm on it! Not if I'm on it first! No, me! Me! <clears throat> Is everything okay over there? Oh, yeah. Bandage coming right up. <sighs> what? Uh-oh. Looks like you two could use some help. Help? Me? But I'm the best helper in Sweetwood. No way. I am. Yep, Fergie. <sighs> I guess I'll have to help Brickley on my own. Huh. Now that I think about it, I don't think we've been very helpful today, have we? Uh, no, Popcorn, we messed up big time. We were supposed to be helpful, but now we're all wrapped up. I could see that. Want to know my secret to being Vita's helper? What? Tell us. You gotta stick together. That's rule number one. You gotta help each other to get things done. Because when you work together, everything runs smooth and there's nothing that you can't do. Take turns. You first. Listen carefully. Good idea. And try not to yell. Stay calm. <sighs> it's not a contest. Remember, you're here to help. You gotta stick together. That's rule number one. You gotta help each other to get things done. Yeah, when it comes to helping, we're a team of two. You got me. We work together. Great job. Now everybody. When we work together, everything runs smooth and there's nothing that we can't do. Yeah, nothing that we can't do. <sighs> now it's rest for me. I'm sorry it took us so long to learn we had to work together, Vita. Yeah, I'm double sorry. I mean, we're both sorry. Can we still maybe help? Pretty please with a lollipop on top? <laughs> of course. We have a few more patients that could use your help. Ready to work together? Definitely! Yeah! <laughs> mm. Great work, team. There's 
only one more patient to check on today. Looking good, Popcorn. And lollipops! You two were great helpers today. Thanks for saving the day. We do make a great team, don't we? You can say that again. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. Come on, Popcorn. I think it's time we both get some rest. Hmm? Welcome back from Sweetwood. Okay, friends, it's trivia time. Pay close attention to the clips and then answer the question after. Ready? Can Popcorn and I sign your cast? Sure. There you go. Question one. What do Vita and Popcorn draw on Toby's cast? A star, a square, or a heart? Time's running out! And the answer is... A heart! Welcome, Banjo! Question two. What color is Banjo's sweater? Green, blue, or red? the answer be? And the answer is... Banjo's sweater is red! <laughs> Question 3. What animal does the team scrub down in the bath? Pippin the koala, Sunny the mouse, or Koa the tiger? the answer be? And the answer is... Sunny the Mouse! Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube! Whenever you need me, I'll be ready to help. Hmm, 
Are you ready to help me find my measuring tape? It's not in my vet vest. Huh? Ta-da! I found it in the exam room yesterday when I was tidying up. Thank you, Popcorn. Today will be a breeze with you helping me. You bet, because I'm going to be the best vet tech ever! You may be wondering, what does a vet tech do? Well, I'm a vet tech, so I'll show you. I help with every single thing in this tree. You see this clipboard? It belongs just to me. I organize supplies and make all the tea. I do it all, because I'm a vet tech. I make appointments and know just when they are. I help with casts and always sign with the star. Wherever Vita is, I'm never too far. I do it all, because I'm a vet tech. Bandage for the claw? Thanks. Lollipop? Aww. Popcorn. Coming. I can tell you're nervous. It's OK. Hold my ball. I do it all. He does it all. I do it all, because I'm a vet tech. I'm here all week. Can you please prep the x-ray room for later? The best vet tech ever is on it. Hey, it's me. <laughs> popcorn the skeleton. Go, Popcorn. Go, Popcorn. Go! Go, go! Huh? Oh, no. What happened? It's okay. I can fix it. Uh-oh. I broke the x-ray machine? <gasps> I broke the x-ray machine! This is not what the best vet tech ever would do. <gasps> Our next patient! Be right there! Phew! <gasps> Sorry for the wait, Kip. That's a okay. You sounded busy, so I tried these stickers. Cool. Oh, but those are oopsie bandages. Oh, whoops. Sorry to waste. Oh, no, we're out of oopsie bandages. Popcorn, can you get more, please? And I'll start Kip's checkup. The best vet tech ever is on it. <laughs> X-ray machine. I'm trying to be the best vet tech ever. Please help me, okay? At the count of three, you'll work. One, two, three. Ugh. Why won't you work? Ah, the next patient. Hey, Zigzag. Vita's with another patient. But your checkup will be very soon. <laughs> Okie dokes. I also have a little boo-boo on my elbow. Do you happen to have a little oopsie bandage? I forgot the oopsie bandages. Be right back. Bandages, bandages, where are they? Hmm, think, think. Hey, Popcorn, just making sure the x-ray machine is ready to go when Sunny arrives. Uh, well, uh, when you need it, it'll be all ready. Woo, best vet tech ever. <sighs> I gotta fix that machine. Thanks, Popcorn. <sighs> Coming. <sighs> Coming. Oh, too hot, Popcorn. <clears throat> hmm? Thank you, Popcorn. My pleasure. Before Sunny arrives. Think, think, think. <gasps> I got it! Work! Please. Oh, I'm supposed to be the best vet tech ever, not the x-ray machine breaker. Vita's gonna be so disappointed in me if she can't use the machine for Sunny. I just needed a little more time. Popcorn. Huh, that's strange. I thought Popcorn was at his desk. He can't be too far. Can you find him, Tippet? Okie dokie. I'm an expert hide and seeker. I can't let anyone see this. 
<laughs> come out, come out, wherever you are. Popcorn! I found you! Sure did, Tidbit. Um, you're here early. <laughs> I came to soak in the tub for an extra few minutes. I've been playing in the mud a lot, so I want my shell to be so fresh and so clean. Sounds like we'll be adding extra bubbles. I'll show you to the washroom. Thanks, Popcorn. This is A-plus patient care. Today's a big day for Sunny. That's right. Your cast comes off. You're ready, Sunny? Really, really ready. Look at the cool pictures my friends drew for me. Ah. Let's check on that arm. To the exam room we go. We got your cast off nice and easy. Some patients like to keep their cast for good memories. Would you like to keep yours, Sunny? Yes, please. Here you go. Thank you. Now, Sunny, let's test your wrist. You say owie if anything hurts, okay? Gently move your wrist up and down. Good. Make a fist. Great. Now hold up two fingers. One, two, no owies! <laughs> you did great, Sunny. I can go swimming now? <laughs> Not so fast. Wearing a cast helps you heal your broken bone. But just to be sure, let's take a quick x-ray so we can see the bone. Uh-oh. What if, uh, we do some more tests? Like clapping really loudly. That's gotta be better than an x-ray. Or shaking hands. Or throwing a ball. Never mind, we don't have a ball. Great ideas, Popcorn. But an x-ray is exactly what Sunny needs. Follow me. Oh, no! Huh. Strange. I doubt the x-ray machine would be on already. and throwing silly poses. I was popcorn the skeleton, and now the machine is broken, and Sonny can't get his x-ray, and I'm not the best vet tech ever. And, and I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you for being honest, Popcorn. You mean, you're not angry, Vita? No, but next time, it's okay to just tell the truth, and then I can help. Because I'm just as much your helper as you are mine. I promise to always be honest and ask for help. Will you help me fix the x-ray machine, Vita? Yes, I will. Hmm, I need a closer look. I'll use my magnifying glass. Good idea. Uh -huh. Hmm. Ah, I see what the problem is. You didn't break a thing. This green button is off when it should be on. That's it? Yep. That's why two heads are always better than one. You do the honors. We did it! Hooray! <laughs> Ready to see your bones, Sunny? What if it's not better? There's only one way to find out. Your bones are all better. Okay. I think there's only one thing left to do. Join me, Popcorn. You're all better. You're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> Can I go swimming now? Please, please, please? Well, if it's okay with your mama, you're fine to go swimming. And, fun fact, mice can hold their breath underwater for up to three whole minutes. Wow, I bet I can hold mine longer. <gasps> Let's go swimming. <sighs> swim, ming, swim, ming. Thanks, Vita. Thanks, Popcorn. <sighs> he was our last patient of the day. Thanks, Popcorn. You're definitely the best vet tech ever. And 
am the cutest. <laughs> Definitely the cutest. Okay, friends, it's trivia time. Pay close attention to the clips and then answer the question after. Ready? Thank you, Popcorn. Today will be a breeze with you helping me. You bet, because I'm going to be the best vet tech ever! Question one. Who is Vita's vet tech? Koa, Popcorn, or Juno? What could the answer be? And the answer is... <sighs> popcorn! Who is our last patient of the day? Thanks, Popcorn. You're definitely the best vet tech ever. And the cutest? Today's a big day for Sunny. That's right! Your cast comes off! You are ready, Sunny? Really, really ready! Look at the cool pictures my friends drew for me! Ah! Question two. What did Sonny have removed? His tooth, his hair, or his cast? Time's running out. And the answer is... His cast. We got your cast off nice and easy. Some patients like to keep their cast for good memories. Would you like to keep yours, Sunny? Yes, please. Can I go swimming now? Please, please, please? Well, if it's okay with your mama, you're fine to go swimming. And, fun fact, mice can hold their breath underwater for up to three whole minutes. Wow, I bet I can hold mine longer. <gasps> Question three. How long can mice hold their breath underwater for? Three minutes, five minutes, or ten minutes? I don't know. And the answer is... Mice can hold their breath for three minutes. Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. Popcorn. Thanks. Be right back. Mama Hippo, how can I help you? I'm here for Juno's appointment. Let's see. These are the animals with appointments today, but where's Juno? Yeah. Hoka! Phew. Thanks, Juno. Welcome. Oh, Vita! Look at ye luck! <laughs> wow, Juno! 
Bravo. You're moving around so well. And so fast. Well, fun fact, hippos can run very fast, even faster than people. That is a fun fact. Now here's a fun question. Why is she wearing that big shoe? My shoe? <laughs> cast. Juno broke a bone in her leg a while ago, and the cast keeps her leg safe and still while it heals. Well, if she can do that, the bone must be healed. Yay! Cast up now? Oh, uh, I'd love to take your cast off, Juno, but... But you're early. Your appointment isn't until later today. See? Oh, my. I, I must have made a mistake. Oh, no. Sorry, Juno. I have some important house calls to make today. But if you wait here, I can take your cast off as soon as I get back. Okay? Okay! All right, Juno. Thanks for... Yeah! Done waiting. Go with Zina? It's fine with me. Okay, okay, you can come. But you have to be patient while I'm with the other animals. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> Juno wins! Wow, hippos are fast. Mmm, carrot flavored. Okay, Kip. According to this, you feel like you have something in your ear? What? I said, you think you have something in your ear? Sorry, can't hear you. I think I have something in my ear. Okay, Juno, I have to help Kip now. Can you wait here until I'm done? Okay. I wait. Thanks, Juno. Hey, there's my favorite fox. Hi, Vita. My ear really, really hurts. Can you help? Of course. You'll feel better in one, two, three. Now let's get a look in that ear of yours with my otoscope. Otoscope? Huh, that's strange. I don't see anything wrong. Oh, good. Yeah. Cast off now? <laughs> Juno, I'm not done helping Kip yet, so I still need you to wait. Okay, I wait. Let's try this again. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see now. My diagnosis is you have a little water in your ear. But it's an easy fix. Just tilt your head and hop on one foot until the water comes out. What? <laughs> Why don't we show you? Popgrin, let's hop to it. <sighs> like this. Come on, Kip. Look, I hop too. Cast off now? <laughs> Not yet, Juno. Oh, oh, I get it. <gasps> it worked. My ear doesn't hurt anymore. Aw, I'm so happy to hear it. You're all better, you're all done. Now go out and have some fun. <laughs> Kippo better than me all done waiting. <laughs> okay, Juno, let's go. Thank you! My turn, my turn, it's my turn, yay! Uh, Juno, it's not actually your turn yet. I still have other animals to take care of first. Huh? How many? Oh, not too many. Vita can help you right after this patient, and that patient, and... Oh, we better get moving. Okay. Hi, Koa. What's bothering you? I accidentally pinched my tail, and now it really, really hurts. Can you help? Of course, Koa. You'll feel better in one, two, three. <laughs> Cast off now? Not yet, Juno. It's still Koa's turn. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Psst, Vita. 
I think Juno is having a really hard time waiting. That's why we've got to work fast. Come on, let's bandage up Koa's tail as quick as we... All better. You better do fun. Now you have fun. <laughs> um, thanks for your help, Juno. You're welcome. There you go. I just fixed it up a bit. Thanks for your help. Cast off now? <laughs> Not yet, Juno. You know I'm here to help, that's just what I do. But there's a few more animals still in front of you. So be patient, a patient, patient. When there is someone else to treat, we need you to take a seat and be patient. Oh, okay. How? You can read a book. All done. You can play a game. I won. Draw a picture. Take it slow. Look, I draw me. Now we go. Be patient, a patient, patient. When there is someone else to treat, we need you to take a seat and be patient. You're right here on the list, so if you could just resist, it really would be great to see you sit and wait somewhere, some way, somehow. Cast up now? Oh, please, please, please be patient. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> now, General Turn? <sighs> Popcorn, how many more patients do we have? Let's see. Hmm. <gasps> You're not gonna believe this, but we only have one patient left. Please be me. Please be me. It's... It's no! Juno! <laughs> that means I can take your cast off as soon as we get to the clinic. Yeah! Yes! Can't wait! We noticed. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that hippo is so fast. Oh, hey, wait for me! <laughs> that is in. That you! That is in. Gina, too! Hello? Hello? Hey, Birdie, what's wrong? I hurt my wing. Can you help? Of course. You'll feel better in one, two, three. Oh, but there's another patient I need to help first. Can you wait here? Oh, okay. All right, Juno, follow me. Oh. Oh. Juno, the vet will see you now. Whew. No. I wait, Fia. Birdie, go first. That's very kind of you. But are you sure you want to wait? I feel better in one, two, three. After Birdie. Huh? Thanks, Juno. Oh, Birdie. Come on. <laughs> it's your turn now. Thanks for waiting patiently, Juno. It's your turn now. Yay! <laughs> Just as I thought, Juno. Your bone is good as new. Cast off now? <laughs> Cast off now. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yay! All better! Oh, Juno. That's wonderful. <laughs> you know, when your wing is all better, your cast can come off, too. How about now? <laughs> Birdie, be patient. Okay. Thank you again, Vida and Popcorn. You're welcome. Anytime. Come on, Popcorn. Let's go home. Are we there yet? Not yet. How about now? Not yet. How about now? Oh, Popcorn. <laughs> Be patient. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Welcome home, Vida. 
Okay, friends, it's trivia time. Pay close attention to the clips and then answer the question after. Ready? Why is she wearing that big shoe? Not shoe. <laughs> Cass! Juno broke a bone in her leg a while ago, and the cast keeps her leg safe and still while it heals. Question one. What symbols are on Juno's cast? A flower, a sun, a butterfly, a heart, or a tiger? Time's running out! And the answer is... A flower, a sun, and a butterfly. You'll feel better in one, two, three. Now let's get a look in that ear of yours with my otoscope. Otoscope? Question two. What does Vita use to look in Kip's ear? A stethoscope, tweezers, or an otoscope? What do you think? And the answer is... An autoscope! Let's try this again. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see now. My diagnosis is... You have a little water in your ear. <laughs> Hi, Koa. What's bothering you? I accidentally pinched my tail, and now it really, really hurts. Question three. What part of Koa's body did he accidentally pinch? His arm, his tail, or his nose? What could the answer be? And the answer is... His tail! Ouch! Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube. help over there? No, thank you. I can do it by myself. Hmm. Hmm. Later. <sighs> Bye, Dad. Love ya. Love you, too. Have fun in Sweetwood. Hey, Vita, wait up. I guess a breakfast smoothie really does give you energy. Whew. I should have had one to keep up. I'll save you some next time. Deal! With broccoli, kale, turnip... Wait, do I like turnip? <laughs> the bat is in! That's me! The bat is in! Hello! Giant dozen giraffe! Or dimmy as a bug! Whoa. Everyone's welcome for checkups and hugs! Love your singing. Don't love 
this owie. Vita, can you help? Of course. To the exam room. Okay, Zigzag. This patch will protect the scratch on your eyelid from dirt so it can heal faster. Good. I like fast. Are you done? <laughs> Not yet. Are you done now? Um, Zigzag, think you could try to be a more patient patient? I don't have time to be patient. I'm in a really, really extra super big rush and... Oh, you're done? <laughs> yep. You're all ready. You're all done. Great. Gotta... This is itchy. Uh, uh, uh. Oops, forgot to tell you. No touching your eye or it won't heal. Oh. Okay. Uh, maybe just one scratch? Eh. Eh. Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Uh, this is a... oh. But it's itchy. Hmm, I know. We'll give you a cone so you don't touch it. And then I can go? Then you can go. Popcorn, could I have a cone and right up? <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Thanks, Vita. Now I can... Oops. Go! Just <clears throat> gotta ow, get ow! Uh-oh, Zigzag. It looks like you can't see so well with your cone. Sure I can. Gotcha. Now I can. I got it. I got it. Hey, I got it. <laughs> nice save, Popcorn. Why, thank you. Gotta go! Wait, your cone and eye patch will be off by the end of the day. But until then, you shouldn't go out on your own, because you can't see well. But, 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 I need to deliver my carrot bread now, Vita. Well, it's still warm. It tastes the best when it's warm. Aww. Mmm. Carrot bread is super delicious. Thanks, Zigzag. You're welcome. Don't worry, Zigzag. I know exactly how you can deliver your bread quickly with the help of a service snail. A who? What? What? <laughs> a service snail. I just had to go do it. It's not safe to walk alone when you can't see well, but it is safe to walk around with a service snail. He'll guide you. I don't need a service snail. Thanks anyway. Hello, I'm here and ready to help. Molasses, come on in. I don't need help. I know where everything is in Sweetwood, so I don't need to see everything to get around. But since you can't see everything, I'd feel better if Molasses was looking out for you today. And, fun fact, land snails are great lookouts because they have eyes on top of their tentacles that can see in every direction. Really? I don't know how you do that, Molasses. It's amazing. Aw, oh, shucks. It's nothing. But d I I'm fast, and he's a snail. It'll never work. No, no, no. Nuh uh. No. 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 Don't worry, Vita. I can keep up. Zigzag, I'm here if you need me. I won't, because I got this. Whoa, you really are fast. I gotta be. I'm delivering carrot bread to my friends and it tastes the best when it's warm. Wow, that's really nice. I've never had a friend bake for me before. You must be a great friend. Why, thank you, I am. And thanks for helping, but I don't need it. Look, I'm doing great all by myself. Ow! Excuse me, sir. You sure you don't need any help? I'm positive. I know exactly where I'm going. <laughs> if you don't need help, how about a towel? I'm fine. Whoa, maybe I'm the one who needs a towel. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Aha! You don't have to follow me because, as you can see, I'm at my first stop, Grandpa Beaver's house. Uh, Zigzag. Oh, hi, Zigzag. Can I help you? Um, uh, I. Whoa! Oh no! Ow! I bumped my knee. Your knee does have a tiny scratch. I'll put an oopsie bandage on it, and you'll feel better in one, two, three. 
Oopsie. Bandage. <laughs> I think you popcorn. You're welcome. So, I know you don't need any help, but maybe Molasses could walk with you and be your lookout. Just to make sure you don't get any more boo-boos. Well... No, thanks. Gotta go before my carrot bread gets cold. See ya. Uh-uh-uh. Let's just try letting Molasses help. That's orders. Okay. Good luck keeping up, Molasses. Don't worry. I love a challenge. How does Molasses wind like that? No, really. Practice. You're a little off the path. I'm fine. This is the way I want to go. But... Bush! Who put that bush there? I don't know, but I'll be on the lookout for more. Hello? Anybody home? Huh. Guess not. Um... Stop! Chipmunk directly ahead! Ah, oh, nuts. I thought I knew where everything was, but I can't find anyone's house. I'll never get my friends the bread in time. You will if you accept a little help. Zigzag, I know you like to do things by yourself, and so do I. But we can't do everything on our own. Popcorn helps me, and Vita helps me a lot. And I mean a lot. When there's something I can lift, cause I'm too small. Or something I can't reach, cause I'm not tall. Or something I can see, cause I can hardly see it all. Yeah! I could use a helping hand. And we are always here to help. Yeah, just say when. Then if you need more help, just ask. are lucky to have a friend like you. Oh, thanks, Molasses. But I think I'm the lucky one because I have such good friends. Now, let me see. We delivered to everyone. I made all the stops. Then I guess we're done. You two make a terrific team with terrific timing. Zigzag, I think your eye should be healed so I can take off that patch and the cone. Yes, my eye feels great. And Boo Boo Free! Yay! Lollipop? Mm, carrot flavored. My favorite. Thanks, Vita. Well, I better get going since all your friends got their warm bread. Wait! Not all my friends got their bread. Ta da! Whoa. For me? Yep. Turns out I did need help. Thanks for helping me and for being a great new friend. Thank you. This calls for a carrot bread new friend picnic. Great idea! And I know the perfect spot. So this time, I'll lead. Bye bye! Bye bye! Bye! Hey, popcorn, I think it's time to go. <clears throat> a little hope, please. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Uh, Dad, can I have a little help, please? Sure thing. I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> Actually, everyone can use a helping hand sometimes. And done. Beautiful. <gasps> okay, friends, it's trivia time. Pay close attention to the clips and then answer the question after. Ready? Okay, Zigzag. This patch will protect the scratch on your eyelid from dirt so it can heal faster. Good, I like fast. Are you done? <laughs> Question one. What does Vita give Zigzag to help her eye scratch? 
an ice pack, star-shaped sunglasses, or an eye patch? I don't know. And the answer is... Vita gives Zigzag an eye patch. Hello, I'm here and ready to help. Molasses, come on in. Question two. Who is molasses? A bear, a chef, or a service snail? I don't know. And the answer is... A service snail! I'd feel better if molasses was looking out for you today. And, fun fact, land snails are great lookouts! Cause they have eyes on top of their tentacles that can see in every direction. Really? I need to deliver my hair bread now, Vita! Well, it's still warm. It tastes the best when it's warm. It is super delicious. Question three. What did Zigzag bake? Carrot bread, a salad, or banana bread? Time's running out. And the answer is... Zigzag baked carrot bread. Watch full episodes of Vita the Vet, now streaming on YouTube.